Hey, this is Charles Calhoun, AKA the Shade Tree Pro. I'm gonna show you something today here. One of the biggest things in golf, or biggest things that people overlook in golf, is the head. And I see everybody trying to keep the head still, swing around a center pivot in a sense. But that's not really how the head works in, in, in any athletic motion. The head has to move, but you just gotta know how to move it properly. Well, one of the biggest things, I'm gonna take a piece of tape here and I'm gonna show you how the head works. I call this rocking the jaw. The strongest muscles in the face in itself uh, here, you know, is your, I think it's uh, the, the jaw muscles that's here on your side, just below your ears. So I'm gonna show you a little bit of, little bit of something here. Now, if you look how I got this tape and I take it and I go from ear to ear, notice how it has an arc. See how it creates an arc? So in the golf swing, that's all we're doing from the jaw lines all we're doing is making an arc with our head. Now, when we make an arc with our head because our eyes are there, everything, the, the swing in itself will follow. Most of us are taking our head and we're not making an arc that's towards the ground. We're making an arc that goes around here, a la, this is why everybody is spinning out of the golf swing. So, like I said, I call, you know, this, you know, ear to ear, jawbone, how you do it. But see here, simple. And I make a little move. And I just basically make my jaw rock. And when the jaw rocks, the body, the arms, and everything else has no other choice but to follow it. Now the body's not spinning all over the place. You know, I see these people talking about, you know, you got to get here the impact and all that. So what? When you got to get here the impact, guess what? The head is going that way. But the conflict comes into play is because the head actually wants to because the eyes want to follow the, the arc that you're creating with the ball or with the swing. So learn to rock the jaw here, or you can feel it here. However, just make sure that the jaw rocks. Now you notice, not really there yet, but that moves in itself. But wherever our head is, it pretty much tells us where, how we're shifting our body. So rock the jaw. I mean, even hitting little shots, rock the jaw. Even hitting little, little draw shots, whatever, rock the jaw. Even hitting little punch shots, rock the jaw. Even hitting little pull holes, rock the jaw. Charles Calhoun, AKA the Shade Tree Pro, once again, if you haven't gotten my book, The Dead Finger in the Middle Wrist, go to ShadeTreePro.com and get that book today because all of these little serendipitous type of actions that I'm understanding is coming from the simple fact is that my dead fingers has released my central nervous system to allow me to be able to hit great golf shots day in and day out. Charles Calhoun, AKA The Shade Tree Pro, and always good golfing.